So over the years, I have used this, I have used that, and all quality products, but this, this one is different. And hey everyone, um, I hadn't so planned on doing this video today, but when I woke up this morning and brushed out my hair, I thought, whoa, something is different here. I think I'm going to share this new product I'm using with my viewers right here, right now on One With Gray Hair. Most of us have heard of keratin type products. Uh, that are available all over the market now. But this one, um, there was something about it when I saw it in action. I thought, you know what? I'm going to bite the bullet and I'm going to try it. And I purchased these three products. There were other products that the reviewer talked about. Shampoo, a conditioner, all made by the same company. But I already have a wonderful quality product that I use for uh, shampoo and I'll get into that in a moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to tell you exactly what I did, exactly what I used, and then you'll understand hopefully why I'm so excited about this product. Now as you can see I don't have super thick luscious hair, but I do have hair and I love my hair. I love the fact that I have hair. I love the fact that over the years it's it's changed from gray to silver and now it's changed to white but this hair is very fragile uh, if you have white hair or gray hair you know that it it acts so much differently than before you transitioned to gray or white so over the years i have used this i have used that and all quality products but this this one is different and um, so let me just go through them with you one by one. I'm simply going to talk about it today. I'm not going to show you anything about what I did, but this is a very strong endorsement for this product, uh, Keratin. So the very first thing I do, and again, remember, I'm telling you that they do have a full line. They have shampoo. They have conditioners. They, they have everything that you could possibly want. But I've invested so much in other products that I thought, well, let me just try and use what I have in combination with these three products that I thought would really make a difference in my hair. So the very first thing that I did was I used Phyto Detox. And I'll link everything below, but Phyto Detox. And you just squirt a little bit of this into your hand. You massage it into your scalp. You can do it either on dry hair or wet hair. I usually do it as a first step in the shower. And it really cleanses the scalp. So I detox at least once a week. I only wash my hair twice a week. So do I really need to detox? I don't know, but I do it anyway. And it really, I think, makes a difference in the scalp. Okay, so after the Fido, step number two was I used this um, shampoo. It's from a company called Function of Beauty. And the cool thing about Function of Beauty is, I don't know if you can see that, but you can have your name on the bottle. <laughs> Function of Angela. Okay, it's kind of cute, kind of gimmicky, but this is a great product. It doesn't have anything bad in it. It's just pure goodness for your hair. And I'll link it below. I purchased all these products with my own money. Uh, so, so I don't have an affiliate code or a discount code per se, but I'm going to tell you where you can get it. And a little bit goes a long way, and it's it's luscious. It really leaves your hair beautiful, not stripped, very clean, and I highly, highly recommend it. I actually found out about this product from Dr. Dre. If you know who Dr. Dre is, she is a um, dermatologist, has a very large following on YouTube. So I did pick that up. You know, everything comes with these guarantees. You can send them back, but no, not sending them back. And then the other thing, instead of conditioning my hair, I have a lot of beautiful conditioners, but instead of conditioning it per se with Function of Beauty's um, conditioner, I opted to go with the Bali Biolage, Biolage, and I only put the Biolage on from like my ears down. I did not rub it into my hair. I just coated um, my hair with it, left it in there for a couple of minutes, and then moved on. Okay, so then coming out of the shower on towel dry, damp hair, 
Make sure you use one of those microfiber towels. You don't want to be using anything that's going to rough up the cuticle, which causes frizz. So microfiber uh, towels will do that. If you don't have a microfiber towel, get yourself an old t-shirt and that will do the same thing. Okay, so now my hair is damp and the very first thing that I did was I sprayed it with the intense, ex in extensive thickening treatment. So I sprayed that all over my hair liberally um, and then just kind of worked it in with my fingers. After that, I, in preparation for blowing drying my hair, I use the keratin volumizing mousse. Now this is day three. You might be thinking, well, her hair doesn't look so full and lush, but this is day three. For someone who has very thin hair, I think just to even have this amount of volume without it being stuck to my head, for me, that is huge. And it feels better. And this product is supposed to, as you use it, uh, it says, for long-term benefits, the unique ingredient Nature, nature Pep Amaranth increases thickness from the inside. I've only used this now twice in the last week and I'm already raving about it so I can imagine what another month will bring. Finally when I was styling I used the Keratin's Root Volumizer and I love that they have this little pump and you can target it right where you need it at the root. So I went ahead styled my hair as usual and um, went on and I'm sorry I don't have a picture of how my hair looked after it was styled but it really was so full and and so beautiful I used my Dyson air wrap yes I know Dyson air wraps are pricey but when you've got these this fine fragile hair you want to be very very careful about how you are styling it and how, certainly the kind of heat that you're applying to it. So if your finances allow, again, I highly recommend Dyson. My husband bought me the Dyson hair dryer a few years ago for my birthday. I almost fell off the chair when I, when I saw the price, but I have never looked back. It's a beautiful way to, to style your hair. My hair has no uh, damage at all. It's not dry. It's, it feels soft. But the big thing for me is this is day three. Now, if I wanted to, I could absolutely just go back in and dry hair and spray some. And I did this yesterday. I restyled my hair with this and it came out beautiful. Now, I will say, disclaimer, nothing, nothing is ever going to make your hair look as full and voluminous as the very first day you style it, especially with thin hair. You really need to style it when it's wet, work fast. Oh, and the other thing that I used were these wonderful Velcro hair curlers, and uh, you put those on after you've blown dried your hair. It's still a little bit warm, and you put the style and you put the curlers in, and then you just clip it. And then after you've done your whole head, you take it out and boy, do you have a lot of volume in your hair. So those were all the things that I did just to help my hair look the best that it could look. At some point, I'll do a full video on exactly what I did. Now, I told you what I did, but it would be nice to see exactly what I did. But I think that you can pretty much imagine. The main point here is to tell you this product and I have used beautiful products over the years. The point is is that these three products right here work. They work beautifully. Will they work on your hair? Will they work on everybody's hair? I don't know, but I can tell you they work on my thin, fragile white hair. And as I said, they all come with this with this guarantee that if you don't like it, you can send it back. So, but I think that you're going to like it. I love it. So, I'm at the point again where I'm growing out my hair. I know a lot of people feel that if you ha if you're older, you shouldn't grow your hair. I'm just not in that camp. I I love feeling the wind in my hair. I love being able to pick it up and put it on my head on a hot day. I could still throw on a wig if I want a different look. But just to land the plane, I hope that you'll give keratin a try. Um, I think you'll love it. Let me know in the comments what you think.
Let me know in the comments if you've tried keratin. I would love to hear from you. So let's take care of the hair that we have, whether it's a lot or whether it's a little. Coming up next is my review of the wig you see right there. Her name is Ultimate by The Wig Company. And that review will drop this coming Sunday. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>